What is up, guys? Today I am with Daniel Wagner from Fitness FAQ, and I'm gonna take him from his L seat to a V seat. Let's get to it. So, are you ready today? I don't know if I am, but I'm willing to learn what you've got to show me. The L sit isn't something I work mm -hmm. on. Hip flexor strength is an area I need to improve, mm -hmm. but take a look at my L sit, break me down head okay. to toe, let me know what I need to do. Show me your L sit. Okay. Show me what you got. Actually, show me your V sit. V sit, okay. Show me your best V sit. L sit. Good. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Perfect. So it's clearly hip flexor strength. Yeah. Yeah, like you have the tricep strength. Let me see your shoulder flexion. So if you stand right here, extension, I mean. Try to keep a shoulder width. Okay. It could improve a bit, but my, our main focus right now is going to be on hip flexors because how you know that is that your L sit is here. So you have the strength. The only thing is that you need to bring this closer to you. Compression. So yes, so we're gonna do a, we're gonna be working with blocks, just because it makes things easier. Sure. Since you have more leverage to actually lift up. So what I want you to do is, first one you're going to do is you're gonna get into an outfit, then bring your knees as close as you can go, yeah. then go here and work on the negative. Oof. Only two reps. If you can get to three, you'll make I'll, me proud. You, you'll make me proud. Got to make him proud. Let's go. No matter the quality, let's show him the effort, right? Let's go for it. Go, tuck, now extend. I know he's gonna, okay, and then come down. Good. Go back, try to point up, up, up. Good, nice. One more. Tuck it in, bring it up, bring it up, and negative. Good. Now, relax, seated forward fold, inhale right away, and relax your central nervous system. Good. Now, what I want you to do, even though we're doing a passive stretch, is use the antagonist muscle of the hamstring that we're trying to stretch to pull yourself into the stretch. So use your muscles to go deeper. Now, I want you to contract for five to seven seconds in three, two, one. Contract five, four, three, two, one. Now, relax, absolutely relax. Let go of your breathing and just relax into the stretch. Try to breathe slower through the nose, and if you can exhale through the nose, it's even better. We're gonna do that contraction one more time, especially right here on your hip flexors. So three, two, one, contract as much as you can, like like bringing your left your legs up, even though they don't go. Yeah, now I feel it. Okay, contract, contract, relax. Now inhale, lift your chest a little higher, and fall a little forward. So his flexibility is actually really, really good in comparison to like a, an average yo that doesn't work on flexibility or mobility. But now, if you try the visit, you're gonna be able to go actually higher. Okay. So just give me just one hole. I don't want you to tire too much. Good, good, okay, relax. Okay, Ooh. okay. Give it a little shake, like extend a little bit your hip flexors. Do you get any cramp, any, any? I felt it on the extension based drill, but okay. now, now it's okay. Okay. Now we're gonna do a superset of the all common one seated pie compression. You're gonna give me 10 of those. Then you're gonna give me a 10 second hold here. Then you're gonna place your hands here. You're gonna slide back and you're gonna give me 10 of those. So 10, 10, 10, it's a triple set. One, two, three, point your toes, four, good, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and hold for ten. Nine, eight, keep raising higher. Five, four, I want to cram, three, two, higher, two, one, and set it down. Now place your hands on the, on the ground, slide back, and bring. Can I do fingertips because I'm not sure if I'm. You can, you can put your hands behind and just slide back. Try to do it on your hands, if you can. Not and just slide back. Yeah, Not happening? Okay, yeah. that's what the blocks are for. <laughs> Imagine your chest to your knees. Imagine your abdomen to your quads. Good, 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 good. Give me 
Give me only six. Three, good. Four. Five, good. And one more. And six. Nice. Now we're going in passive stretching. Relax the central nervous system. Inhale, lift your chest as high as you possibly can. And exhale, fall. Good. Let's involve the calf a little bit, so flex your feet towards you. Good. Nice. Now let's see if you can take a step forward. Can you grab the lock? Outside of your, your feet. Good. 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 Now I don't want you to pull too much, but I just want you to hang in there. And just in the same way, as I said before, use the muscles of your hip flexors to get deeper into the stretch. Relax your neck. If you tense any part of your body, you're gonna be sending pain signals to your brain. I'm which chill, is, I'm good. Yeah, man. you're chilling, bro, you're chilling. Which is gonna tense your every part of your body. So even if you're stretching our hamstrings, and oh. even if the hamstrings are loose, if you tense your lats, that sends pain signals to you. the neck. So that's why a relaxed breathing is a relaxed muscle. A relaxed mind is a relaxed muscle. A relaxed everything is a relaxed everything. So. Stay in there, we're gonna hold here for about 20 seconds. Focus only on your breathing. Nice. Take a little break. Take a little break. So for the routine, what you would do is the first exercise, three rounds. So you do the exercise, just stretch, do the exercise, stretch, do the yeah. exercise, just stretch. Then you, you shouldn't try to miss it. So you rest and you go to this second exercise, the triple set. You do that three times. So you do it, you stretch, you do it, you stretch, you do yeah. it, you stretch. And the stretching always vary between, you can be here, you can, without this one, like takes the, the stretching of your calf out of the equation. So you can play with flexing yes. and pointing. Also play around with the, the space that you're doing. Okay. Go to one side, single side, and also standing is one of the best ones that you can do because you can do little pulses and gravity allows you to actually go forward. So let's, let's do little pulses, 10, and then a whole of 10 seconds. And then we're gonna try the visit and you're gonna see the difference. Well, we're gonna see the difference in the video after this. So the little pulses forward, good. Four, five, nice. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now hold, relax your head, relax everything. I want you to anteriorly tilt your pelvis a little more. Yes, you can go a little deeper. Nice. You can relax your hands in the ground. Walk the hands a little bit to the left. Good. A little bit to the right. Just stretching this beast. It's like, damn. I think you're taller than me, even in a forward fold, dude. <laughs> now show me a busy. Sure. And we're done. Yo, give me everything you got. Ooh. Give me everything you got. So just a little technique. Start by leaning forward. Like, warm up here. Point your toes. Place your hands, not on a place forward, but like right here, like your arms are bent. You're gonna like protract your scapula yep. so you can lift forward. Starting once you lift, Yeah, and once you lift, you bring the legs as high as you can. It's insane. <laughs> you got it, you got it. Ooh. If you see me, I'm not even bringing my legs, my hips that much. It's all about compression. Lean forward, raise it up, raise it up. Okay, I would say your, your visit looks either the same or maybe a little bit less. But that's super compensation. I think what's happening is you're you've, getting tired. You've course. stressed me so much with the hip flexor strength. Exactly. That I can't display my maximum in that. Exactly. Position. And let's be honest, we just filmed another hip flexor strength workout. We're not so making, you might be tired. No excuses, no excuses but just this to be clear. It needs to be improved with me. Exactly. And that's my weakness. Exactly. And if you rest tomorrow, then you try the visit. Today is Friday, whatever, in two days, then you get me a visit. No, I, wanna, no. I, I want an Instagram picture of, of your visit. Before and after, before, after. How exactly. did that happen? The magic from Gabo. Brother, thank you so much for being here. No worries, man. We got a lot more videos to film. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like the video, subscribe, like, all that stuff. And I will see you guys next time. Thank Peace you. Out. See ya.
your legs, like you don't want to open them that much because that's basically working a lot more on your hips. Maybe you have amazing hamstring flexibility, but your thoracic spine doesn't even flex. Then I would work a little bit more on posterior and other drills more towards that spinal flexion. You can just grab one block, grab the other block, and mix and match it because it is your body, it is your own journey, and we're here just to guide you, but who knows you better than you. So, that's it for today, guys. See you next time.